Hello students, today we are going to do chapter number 20 of Pathfinder book class 5, Political Administrations of India. Let's begin. Topics to be covered, the legislature, the executive and the judiciary. Introduction. The government of India is the ruling authority. It has three branches, executive, legislature and judiciary. India is a democratic country with a liberal system. The president is the head of executive branch and the judiciary includes the Supreme Court and other courts. The president. The president can call for new elections. The president can declare an emergency state if needed. The president must be informed about the important government matters. He or she can pardon prisoners and give amnesty. Elections happen every five years, uh, but in emergency can change. Indian parliaments. India has a government like United Kingdom. The parliament is where laws are made. There are two houses in an Indian parliament. They are named as Lok Sabha and Rajya Sabha. Lok Sabha. Candidates are elected in the territorial constituencies in the elections. There are 542 territorial constituencies in total. Two members from the Anglo-Indian community are nominated. Some government offices and parliament have reserved seats for scheduled caste and scheduled tribes. There have been efforts to reserve 33% of the parliament seats for women. Rajya Sabha. Rajya Sabha has 245 members elected and nominated. Upper house doesn't dissolve but member resign every two years. Lower house handle important tasks like passing laws. Both house works together to change the constitution. They also help elect president of the country. State government. Each state has its own government and laws. State election happen every five years. The chief minister is the head of the state. The governor has important power in the state. The state legislature make laws and oversees the government. State judiciary. There are different courts in India for different areas. The high court is the highest court in the state. The president appoints the chief justice of the high court. High court reviews appeals from the lower court and give decisions. Courts punish those who break the law. Thank you.